Hey guys, rainy day here in New York, and I wanted to show you my new uh, rain barrel addition to the old uh, homestead. I uh, picked this up at a uh, kind of one of those uh, community sales that was half off. Um, unfortunately, I could not find a uh, just a plain Jane, you know, 50 gallon drum, so I ended up having to actually buy a rain barrel. And uh, it was 59 bucks, came with this little uh, plastic stand, which is pretty heavy duty, but you know, wasn't tall enough for me, so I added a couple uh, tall cinder blocks underneath it. And a real simple system. It's got a, uh, you can see, it's got a little screen on top to collect water. And right now I'm just using the uh, runoff from the roof. But I'm going to add some gutters probably later in the season when I get a little spare cash. Had to uh, pre-drill it myself. And uh, pre-drill, I'm sorry, drill it myself. And basically just used a uh, three-quarter inch uh, bulkhead union and a uh, hose bib. I used uh, brass because I wanted it to be a little better quality. I didn't want it to be leaky. And... Uh, that simple, that easy. And right now I've had this thing out for um, all day today. And it rained pretty good today. And uh, actually we are about filled to here. So we are close to two thirds full just on uh, the rain we got today. But we did get a heavy rain today. It was about an inch, almost an inch and a half of rain today. So it's uh, quite a bit of rain. As you can see, it's still pulled up on the top. Uh, luckily, uh, how it worked is all the rain kind of came down, splashed, and just went into the filter there. Definitely not the most efficient system, but we're going to upgrade it as we go along. But right now, I only have a little tiny garden, so I really don't need a ton of water. As you can see, I got my uh, potted plants along the edges there and some stuff in the ground and all that. But we're working on it. Just a small piece at a time, you know, guys. Can't do everything all at once. So there it is. My new rain barrel edition. 52 gallons and uh, more to come, hopefully.